to new word coming in late today from American pop star Ariana Grande after the terror attack this week in Manchester. ABC's Matt Gutman is there. Her concert silenced by that bomb, scattering fans and the carnage. But tonight, Ariana Grande is silenced no more. The pop icon writing in a statement today, we won't let this divide us. We won't let hate win. Vowing to perform again in this battered city, a benefit concert in honor of and to raise money for the victims and their families. All around England, signs of that critical alert. Hospitals ordered to prepare for an attack. And at Manchester this evening, we were there as SWAT teams swarmed downtown. Minutes ago, there was a tremendous amount of screaming here. Police cars swarmed this area, screaming, get down, telling people to get back. That was a false alarm, but it was the real thing at this man's house two hours south of here. When I opened the door, there, there was officers right in front, about three, four officers right at the door pointing guns. His family member arrested one of multiple ongoing searches in this country. And Matt Gutman with us live tonight from Manchester, England, where word has gotten out that Ariana Grande now plans to return, Matt. That's right. And the initial reaction, David, over 2 million likes on social media. And I spoke with folks here in Manchester. They said they can't wait to welcome her back here. And one young woman telling me that it shows that Ariana Grande is not scared of Manchester. David, just look at that incredible memorial there behind you. Matt Gutman, our thanks to you.